Hello everybody and welcome to Romance Falls Tarot. I'm about to proceed here with a um, a general reading for the sign of Aries but with a certain topic. So the topic for today is, is he or she cheating? Um, now this is a general reading but I have um, tunneled it down if you want. Uh, this is why I'm not doing a pick a card but I'm doing a um, I'm going by sign so I'm going to do the 12 signs so that the message will be more concise more precise and it will resonate to uh, more viewers. So that being said this one here is for Aries. Uh, we are June uh, 13th 20. 20. So let's see my friends, Aries, is he or she cheating on you? I'm using for this uh, for this reading here, I'm using a um, the Alice in Wonderland tarot deck and I'm using a little bit of guidance here with our angel oracles. If you do enjoy my readings, please uh, subscribe to my channel so I know that you enjoy them and you like them and that you want to hear more of them. So that being said, Let's begin. Let's see what is going on here. So we have the Knight of Wands. We have the Six of Wands. We have the Eight of Swords. I'm sorry. And we have the Knight of Swords. Now all our cards are in reverse position. And we're going to go to our um, Oracle at the very last. So let's just turn this up so I can show you the card correctly. We know that they're all in reverse here. So what is this... Um, what is this knight telling you? The knight of wands. Now the knight of wands is all about movement. Our, our knights, they're always about movement. They're always moving. They're going. This is about a, um, there's distance. I see there's distance between you and and your partner. Um, perhaps they, they might even have already left or maybe moved out or perhaps you've moved out. Um, and this is just an expected, unexpected. You, you are... It was not expected that somebody was going to move out. Um, this card is all about putting a distance. This is just bad news. Um, this is lacking confidence in this relationship. I feel that there's unfaithfulness, um, even bulliness somewhat. There's bad temper. It's very moody. It's very explosive. This is not a nice situation to be in. Um, we're going to follow this up always with the reverse position, but of the Six of Wands. Our Six of Wands over here are telling us that there is a lack of success in or in the recognition here of this relationship. Uh, there's failure. There's bad news. Um, there's a lack of support going on. Uh, you may even feel alone. You feel abandoned in your quest, in your quest to save this relationship, to find out uh, was he or she truly cheating. Um, following this we have the Eight of Swords where you can not see anything at all. You are completely blindfolded. We have her again. She was in reverse position. The Eight of Swords in reverse. Well, this is all about an escape. So this is about an escape from self-limiting thoughts. Okay, you've had a lot of thoughts lately, um, trying to uh, keep yourself into this relationship, trying to find out what is going on. This is all about fears, old fears um, that have come back. Um, this is about um, losing your grip. This is uh, looking at things from a new perspective. Um, there's been arguments with your partner about this uh, cheating. Um, there's been um, there's been a lot of arguments, and it, the things are not always what they seem. This is what I have to tell you. This is what I'm seeing here. Um, so to solve this, you, I mean, you're really just going to have to go to the root of this issue to see exactly what happened. Um, because right now you're just feeling trapped in, you're feeling happy in this relationship. Um, this card indicates that, you know, everybody is just ready to just end this. And we're following it up always in reversal here with the Nine of Swords who's having just nightmares in the middle of the night here. Uh, this is about being suspicious. This is about having uh, to give up um, deep thoughts. You're not able to sleep at night. Um, these are... are 
dark thoughts um, in an existing relationship. I see darkness. I see inner turmoil. I see negative thoughts. I see being gripped by fear, by doubts. Um, so you know you need to get a hold um, of yourself on all of this. Um, there's, you know. I, Things are just not seeming what they're supposed to be. Uh, things have taken a really bad turn. It seems as though um, if we look at all of these cards put together here, our answer was directly in the first card saying that yes, there was deception. Yes, there is. there was cheating. Is there still cheating? Is there still um, this, this third person? Um, I'm not quite sure. I have a tendency to say yes, but I'm not quite sure of this yet. Um, but I mean, you're trying not to see it. You're trying to, to hide from it somewhat because you don't want to believe it. You don't know where it came from. You're trying to see the root of it. Um, but I mean, this is just haunting you. Somebody has already moved out, I feel. Um, so I think this relationship is... It, is pretty bleak so far um, and what we're getting here as a message is it's just not the right time so um, perhaps the best thing to do here is to just let the dust settle down and uh, leave each other a little bit of time to think to see what to do about this situation where we want to go from here if we want to go somewhere together and uh, at that point um, rediscuss this situation so this ends the um, the reading for is he or she cheating on me? The answer in this case would be yes, he or she is cheating. Um, I do wish you a fantastic day. I hope I was able to give you some uh, clarity on your situation right now and a little bit of guidance on what to do. In this case, we need to take a little bit of break. We need to take a little bit of pause. We need to get our emotions back and to understand what we want out of this. Um, I do wish you a fantastic day. I do wish you a lot of courage. Um, many blessings. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you want to receive more of my messages and more of my readings. And um, thank you so much for being there. Many, many blessings. Have a great day.